And first at five new reporting on a Milwaukee family who says they're being terrorized in their own home. This is truly chilling. In just the past week, they say their house has been shot up and set on fire. Bruce Harrison shares their desperate plea for help. My night life has been a living hell since 2019. He's been raining down terror on me. Patricia Lewis lives in fear of her daughter's ex-boyfriend. She would come home with black eyes. Lewis says he smashed her car windows and home windows many times. That thug, I'm not gonna allow him to run me away from my home. Lewis now says he's coming for her. I hear the gunshot, pow, pow, pow. Lewis says someone shot into her home this past Sunday. Milwaukee police are now investigating. And it was right close to my window, so I jump up in my bed, my leg is burning, and I feel moisture, it's wet. So I jump up, I fall on the floor. The bullet is still lodged in her right leg. She's certain the ex-boyfriend is responsible, but says police tell her they don't have enough evidence yet to make an arrest. I'd like for them to go get that guy. I'd, I'd like him to be taken off the streets. Lewis's cousin, LT Austin, stepped in to hide the family, and it turns out for good reason. On Thanksgiving morning, police say, someone tried to burn down their house. I said, no, 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 no. And then I said, well, how bad is it? He said, it's pretty bad. And that's the last I heard. I just sat there and wept. This fire damage is still so fresh. You can really smell the charred debris and see how the, the heat ripped back the aluminum siding from this home, a home that Patricia Lewis and her family loved and shared for decades. I am grieving the loss of my home and everything that was dear to me, all my pictures, all of my important stuff. I had some important stuff. I, everything is gone. The man she's accusing of the crimes has a lengthy criminal record, but we're not naming him because he's not charged in connection with the crimes at Lewis's home. She believes this terror will only end once he's locked up or dead. His fight is with me for some reason, but the fact that she won't be with him, he told her if she wouldn't be with him, he would kill her whole family. Reporting in Milwaukee, Bruce Harrison, TMJ4 News.